Hot Iron Cookie started life as a small farmhouse business on the Newtonards Donaha D Road. That was six years ago, but now Judith Jackson's on-farm enterprise is big business. As circumstances changed on the 240-acre dairy farm, Judith decided to use her lifelong baking skills to replace the farm income. Now the land is let and the bakery has become a family business producing a large variety of products. The range of baked products um, extend from biscuits through to cakes through to tray bakes, which there could be 20 varieties in the week which are made and pre-packed and sold. And we have a wide range of desserts as well, which are sort of from Bailey's cheesecake, raspberry ruffle cheesecake, through to pavlovas, roulades, and they are all pre-packed and go out frozen um, into the shop's freezers. Judith, who started by turning over £70 of stock a week in her small bakery, now has an outside catering and funeral catering business, but it all takes long hours and hard work. We start Monday morning, half past five, in the bakery. And the staff, they come in at quarter to seven, the first of them, and then the rest follow in at nine o'clock. And by that time, from half past five to nine o'clock, there's a, an expansive stuff sitting for the packers to come in and start to pack. And then um, the roll just keeps going. Cotton Cookies now employs a sizeable workforce and is a source of income for several family members. We have created quite a bit of employment um, in our business. We've had 11 people on the books. My mother and father are actively involved in the business. My father, he cuts all the tray bakes and um, helps pack them. My mother, she would make up all the orders and um, would do all the paperwork that corresponds with those. And I have an aunt who has been with me from day one. Um, what's that, six years ago now? She's here and um, we have a couple of farmers, widows actually, who um, are on the books as well. And of course, as the employment trend seems to be at the minute, um, we have a couple of Lithuanian girls who are invaluable. Judith supports and supplies local butchers in the Ards area. And for customers, it adds a dimension to their shopping. So from small beginnings, this has grown into a business that uses 100 pounds of butter each week, 80 dozen eggs, not to mention making 700 dozen tray bakes in the course of three days. This is Farm Diversification in Action. Ian Harvey for Farm Week TV.